for me, it's really exciting. Um, I enjoy it a lot. It gives me goosebumps just about every time I, I see it. You give them plenty of room. That's perfect right there. And we're coming up on our 10 minute call. We're going to be on the clock here in about 15 seconds. Uh, the area is secured and uh, tarps are laid out. Good to know how strong of a wind you got. About two miles an hour. We do the world's largest American flag you'll see today. On three, ready, three. It's 7,800 square feet. So we're coming up on 30 seconds, 30 seconds to exit. We're going to put 10 flags in the air, uh, and it's a, it's a tribute skydive to all the people that um, were affected, people that died on 9-11, and all of our men and women that are serving their country and have paid the ultimate sacrifice. Plane load order. Our uh, motto is on, uh, on time, on target. We'll switch you up. And uh, we take it very seriously. So the higher we deploy, the more time we can fly without canopy, without flags deployed, and the closer and tighter we can get on the city. Fly like an eagle! And we've offered to uh, um, take up memorabilia for people who have uh, been affected by 9-11. There's a woman, her brother Doug, was uh, killed in the World Trade Center on 9-11. On, uh, and uh, I've been asked to wear this bracelet to honor her brother, and uh, I'm proud to do it. All packed up together, it's 293 pounds. So it's, it's work, but it's a huge honor at the same time, so it's, it's worth all the effort. Face the sun! Four, three, two, one. Mars, right! Mars, right! Second deck to fast track. I've got a visual with jumpers away. It's, it's absolutely gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Nothing like seeing the American flag. When you're up there and you're flying with your teammates and you're seeing all these beautiful flags in the air, it just takes your breath away. Alright. Good job, man. How'd it look? Way to go. Look good, Dan. Look good. So this morning was a rehearsal uh, skydive for a jump that we're going to do on 9-11 over Ground Zero in New York City. Not many, very many people get to, to jump over Ground Zero with an American flag and, and you know, on 9-11. It's a great honor to be able to go back. I was on the team in 08 when we went over. It was very similar to when I saw the Vietnam Wall for the first time. Being able to hang over Ground Zero, that 10-acre hole, and look through my sneakers, it was just like at the wall when you, you just feel all those souls. Just It, it takes up space. 80-some thousand names in Vietnam was just, a, it was just a number until you see it take up space on the wall. Well, that's what seeing ground zero through your sneakers, it was, a, it was that same sort of feeling. Nice.